Good afternoon, everyone. Taking a look at the time lapse over Muskegon. We started off your day with plenty of sunshine, but then the cloud cover did return. Unfortunately, tracking the chance for a few light flurries, potentially even a few light sprinkles throughout the rest of the day and holding on to that cloud cover. Don't worry, tomorrow the sun is expected to return. I know that we have just been so lucky to have the sunshine the past couple of days, so we deserve it yet again tomorrow. Taking a look over Stanton, mostly cloudy skies, a little bit of moisture in the atmosphere and also a similar look over South Haven, holding onto the cloud cover and somewhat of a cooler day. You can see the light snow showers developing over parts of Big Rapids, Macosta, Stantwood, and even Morley. Moving on down towards Alma, Carson City, even Sheridan and Stanton, a little bit of light sprinkles falling closer towards the east. Similar over towards Norton Shores, Grand Haven, West Olive, a little bit of that wintry mix. We are expected to have that move through throughout the rest of this evening. That wider view showing all of the moisture towards our north, a clipper system. This is a very weak system. It's not expected to bring a whole lot of snow and not a whole lot of rain, but we could see some wet roadways as we continue throughout our evening hours. This is a look as our at our visible satellite. So everywhere that it is a black color, that actually means that it's dry sky, so you can actually see the surface. The white is actually the cloud cover, so you can see the really dry air towards the north. That's going to be building in for tomorrow, returning back to that sunshine. Temperatures also, there's quite a bit of a difference across the Midwest. 54 degrees now in South Bend even 57 degrees in Chicago, but closer look now to West Michigan. We, of course, are much colder than that. 39 degrees in Grand Rapids, 35 degrees in Big Rapids, and 38 degrees in Muskegon. Those winds right now coming from the west, they will be shifting coming from the northwest north as that front passes and as the wintry mix develops. Our evening plan are showing drier conditions by 11 p.m., but between 7 and 9 p.m., we will see the potential of a few flurries, potentially even a few sprinkles. Because Coming mostly cloudy to partly cloudy overnight. It will be breezy with an overnight low of 18 degrees. The winds from the north between 10 to about 15 miles per hour. So as we take a look at the future track, that cold front is going to move through that very weak clipper system, mainly for this evening, producing just a little bit of precipitation. Tomorrow, high pressure builds in. We are going to see partly cloudy skies, a really great Thursday. Temperatures will be a little bit warmer, back to about 32 degrees. So not a huge heat wave, but it will be a smidge warmer. Partly cloudy skies are Maine before the cloud cover returns on Friday. We stay dry throughout the day on Friday, but there will be a chance for that cloud cover, all thanks to an approaching system for this weekend. Take a look at these temperatures. A high temperature on Saturday of 59 degrees. Parts of Southwest Michigan will be reaching the 60s this weekend. I can hear everyone behind me just cheering. It's so exciting because we're finally going to have that heat. But we're also going to see a system moving in later in the day. Widespread rain showers overnight Saturday into Sunday morning morning as cooler air sweeps back in, especially for Monday, bringing in the chance for some light snow showers. Stay tuned to Fox 17 as we continue throughout the rest of our week and stay tuned with Fox 17 after the break. We'll have more coming up.